All right, we came home after removing a hive 10 feet from here, a large hive. And we came home to find this in an empty hive. Is this possibly free bees? And if so, where did that come from? So we're hoping that we can get a shot of Maybe I'll hit the auto and let it track. I'm hoping we can get a shot of a queen moving in here. In which case, maybe I need to go a little higher. adjust this just a little bit. Doubt we got. Maybe we'll get lucky and catch one going in. This is uh, this is so weird that they're starting to march in. They're starting to march in. Check it out. It would be nice if a queen would go in. That, that's indignant of a queen. But... Yeah, if they're marching in like that. It's, but I'm kind of curious. Do they go in first, or does the queen go in first? Because they're making the decision here. So are we going to see a queen go in? Afterwards, is she in that ball somewhere? It, it looks to me like they all just decided to start marching in. Isn't that crazy? Uh, it's possible I saw a queen when I put it in, but I, I, I don't know, you know, when I set it up. But I, I believe we have the beginnings of a new hive here. You uh, looked it over pretty good. Oh, there was, no, there was no queen in it before, I assure you. I've had bees in there for uh, two months off and on, mm -hmm. only doing pollen stores, pollen and nectar. No, no eggs, nothing, um, but it's always had stray bees in it from the hives. Mm -hmm. And it's like, if, if the bees truly do make the lead here, then it's possible they'll walk in before the queen does. I mean, you always hear everybody say, the bees make the choice, uh, you know, the workers make the choice, the queen does what they tell them. So, this sure looks like the makings of a new hive to me. It may be a small, it may be, a, yeah, maybe a small swarm, but a swarm nonetheless. Welcome. Yeah, welcome. We love having you here. We will feed you, tend to you, and take you honey. Um, Eventually. No, someday maybe. I'd just be happy if they cast off some more swarms and we, drop them in our yard. Big trees since last longer. We haven't taken any of them. No, no need to. They were building comb, and, and these have comb hanging in there that they can use. We left comb in here, but I was in this hive yesterday, and there was nothing—just a few stray bees, some comb. Some nectar stores in it and some pollen that, like I said, they've been storing up as stray bees for some time now. I won't get in this hive for a week. Um, even if I see a queen walk in, I'm not going to get in this hive for a week. I'm not going to bother it. They are just marching right in. 
I wonder what's up. Yeah, well, the fact that they're bearded underneath is kind of cool. Oh, yeah. But. Let me see here. That might give us a little better view of what's going on. Well, Big fat queen. Mm -hmm. I'd love to see one march right in there. I would love it. They're not aggressive or anything. They're, no, they're you know, just as gentle it, as big trees. Yeah. Well, they're swarming, so it doesn't matter when they're swarming. They're, you know, they're looking for a place to live. <laughs> that would be so cool if this is actually what's going on. I mean, it, there's no fighting, so, and they're calm. I thought it was just robbing at first because we took the hive away. I thought another hive moved in and was just robbing. In fact, I got a, a hive over there that's not so polite. I really thought they were robbing. But it's possible that that hive wasn't being robbed, that it was bearding and it was moving down here. I won't know until I actually get in it. Mm -hmm. But there wasn't but a cup of bees in there. Yeah, yeah. First year beekeepers. Ooh. We got a lot to learn. I want to see him. Come on, show me a queen. It's like one of them game shows. Mm -hmm. Show us the queen. There's a queen. Ding, 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 ding. Family feud. Yeah. <laughs> that would be so cool. I see there's a lot of fanning going on there. The only other possibility is that these are strays that were kept out overnight from our large hive. <clears throat> they came back and didn't have a place to go, so they decided to claim this. That's possible. I, I'm guessing. Unless I see a queen, that's all I can run with. I, I, I mean, it's she could be in there already if, there, if it is a true swarm. But man, what a fast move if, it's, if that's a swarm. It does, but I mean, this is like super fast. Um, we got one in the door, and it's letting everybody in. It's fanning, letting everybody in. Okay, you big butt anyway. You got a heck of a hinder, doesn't she? Yeah. She's thinking, I could have been the queen. <laughs> yeah, you could have been. But she's just, everything's sliding right by her. She's just standing right there waving everybody in. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> like a guy at the edge of the airport with two flashlights. Come on in. Mm -hmm. Move this way. Move along. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Get to work. Now, the, they are starting to dissipate inside, though. They are going inside. Yeah, they are going inside. Oh. I see a couple of them coming back, but they're just standing guard at the door. They're not really going anywhere or doing anything. It's like they go in and get their assignment. And... Yeah. <laughs> and we got 12 minutes left. I wonder if this thing's going to time out enough to see what's going on. Mm -hmm. um, stick through it. i got to watch it now. I can't leave. Fascinated. You're addicted. Yeah, yeah. Bees are very addicting. I got hit by one out here for the first time in two months. I had one hit me yesterday, and I think the only reason it hit me was because that, that robbing that was going on. If it was indeed robbing, now we're thinking it's a possibility. Yeah, that they were just getting ready to change boxes, and uh, and there was a lot of mayhem because of that. Yeah, moving is always a I don't like moving either. Well, we've been here 20 years. I know. Sure, they stand there panning like there's a pain. 
there's a lot of them banned. It's just, I, I don't know. It's, what, they'll do the same thing for food, though. You know, wow. someone's here. There's a feed bowl over here. That's true. Um, but that, all we can do is wait and see. Um, see if they stay. We're going to have to see if that other battery is charged any, because we're going to need it. We're going to get the rest of this. Mm -hmm. And do you want to look for a queen? You want me to go get it? And I'll look for a queen. Oh, I'll go ahead and look. Okay. That's the reason I, why I said this. You said there was 20 minutes left on It's that. not. It's 10 now. Oh. That's why I say it. So if the other one's charged at all, we'll need it. And I specifically asked Matthew, I said, hey, could you it please... It wasn't even attached to the <laughs> camera. <laughs> hey. He's so busy with so many other things. He's got all that software he's working with. Yeah, he had the camera plugged in. Yeah, he's busy. He's so busy in editing, he doesn't even care about filming right now. <laughs> oh my, like, he's silly. Mm -hmm. I picked up the camera and the battery was still there. things just amaze me. These creatures amaze me every day. If I'm not learning out here in the yard, I'm learning on YouTube from, from people like JP, Dirt Rooster, Southern Exposure. You always learn something from these people. You may not always agree with everything they do, but you're going to learn. That's for sure. And a lot of times you won't agree and then if you actually live it instead of just watch it, you may find out that they know a lot more than you think they do. They get a real life perspective. It's, it's one thing to be driving NASCAR, it's another thing to be behind the wheel. I think this is the same thing. Don't ever catch me in a NASCAR. But I won't say never because you never know. Just amazing. And I don't see a queen on the bottom where they were bearded. So it's possible that a queen moved in before we even got out here to see this. But that would answer my question, who goes in first, the queen or the bees, chicken or the egg kind of thing. Obviously the queen went in before the bees did. It would be nice to catch though, just to, to see if she goes in secondary or, you know, with an entourage or what, but I think my video is about to go ding and end to run out of time here folks hope you enjoyed the video I know I did and I'll be looking at this the rest of the day going what's going on in there these bees just moved in yeah, no queen on the bottom just double check I guess I could look up underneath there's no queen on the bottom, honey, so obviously the bees went in first. I just want to make sure she's not on the screen. Oh, wow, that dissipated so fast. Okay. Yeah, I don't see her on the screen either. So, there you go. Top bar hive. Um, 
visitors. Let's see if they stay. How they do. That's a, that's a crazy thing. That's all we got. Yeah, that's it. Isn't that crazy? Mm -hmm. Now we're seeing a little bit of fighting. Who thinks they own it and who actually owns it? Like I said there were stray bees in there. Now we got a feeder full of bees over here. Those bees are active up there. So I'm hoping they're not getting robbed down. Looks like they're busy defending. You can shut that down, buddy. I think we're done filming here. Already <laughs> Another interesting morning. <laughs>